Hello, this is Eric McRae. Um, this past weekend, I uh, worked on a series of small drawings. Um, my friend Paul came by, and he and I were looking at the works together, and he said they reminded him of portals. And uh, not like portholes in a ship, but portals, like passageways. And uh, so that's spelled P O R T A L. And so I titled these. 13 small drawings portals 1 through 13 that happens to be happen to be a eight and a half by 11 inch drawings uh, they're mixed media they are sepia ink India ink with acrylic paint and I added some gold spray paint to them so you'll see some kind of a glistening to them and uh, here was like a kind of like a almost like a Pollock or Motherwell or Klein kind of uh, free abstract expressionist uh, gesture. Uh, these works uh, it's kind of different for me to be so fearless with a drawing medium without having a very specific subject. You know, I've used ink previously to create jazz pieces, uh, definitely to paint the nude. But here, these are not objective works. You'll see here, there's actually acrylic paint there. That's a drop of acrylic. That's acrylic. And you'll see the spray paint I added here on the edges. But you'll see the variance between the black India ink and the sepia-toned uh, brown ink. Very transparent versus the opaque. The white of the paper and then the white of the paint is a different shade of white. Matisse spoke of the different shades of white, uh, the, the, well, the color of white, the color of black. And obviously, this white here is different from the white of the paper. So you'll see in these, these small expressionistic drawings, uh, kind of a really spontaneous um, gesture, a kind of a fluid lyrical line here, drips and splashes of paint coming back, uh, kind of a, uh, a personal calligraphy in these drawings. And I was going to share the, the just the photos of them, but I thought you know, the drawing, the video would give it so much more character. And look at that beautiful kind of splatter and how that line just flows right off the edge. And some of my friends who uh, do drawings who are abstractionists, and you may find a lot of inspiration in these. And for those of you who are collectors, I think they'd be lovely pieces framed up as clusters of a group. Go nicely together. And there's more of that white acrylic. So the, the color of white here and the color of white there. The black versus the different shades of sepia. They're quite organic. I think it, the spatial relationships between the black and the white just keep moving back and forth. What's foreground, what's background. And you see the gold sprayed along there. That's quite lovely, quite lovely. Um, I, I'm really enjoying these works. The more I look at them, the more I like them. And uh, for me, it was just kind of a jumping in the head first uh, with this paper and seeing what would happen. Um, and um, this came out pretty decently. I'm curious whether they're going to lead into larger canvases or not. But. Uh, I feel myself as an artist moving closer and closer to non-objective abstraction in my work. As you know, I can paint representationally, and I do, and I do kind of pop-inspired imagery as well. But these abstract works just really stir me on a whole nother level. Now here's where I actually made a, a mistake and poured a bunch of white paint in one area, white acrylic, and it hardened and dried there, and I allowed it to to stay there on the page and then I did a, a wash over it and you'll see how the uh, ink beaded up on top of the acrylic it makes a really you know interesting mark to add to this uh, really kind of organic uh, abstraction I have here so there we go that's uh, that's number 11 and I mean 12 and here's number 13 so that's 13 12 11, 
10, doing a countdown. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Interested in collecting these pieces? Uh, send me a direct message. Uh, feel free to reach out to me and we can talk price. And if you're interested in buying the whole group, what price that would be for the body of work. So, this is Eric McRae, artist, entrepreneur, art educator Eric McRae. Just excited about these works and just want to share them with you. Uh, hopefully, you found them enjoy, uh, found some enjoyment in viewing them and uh, gained some inspiration concerning your own personal expression as an artist. Take care. Bye.